Strength under control or meekness is a quality that Father God highly values in his sons and daughters. Top of the morning to you. When we consider our true identity with a mind of love and a firm determination to get to know God better, we see in the Beatitudes in Matthew 5.5, 5, Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. Jesus was quoting from Psalm 37.11, which says, The meek shall inherit the earth and delight themselves in the abundance of peace. Meekness is not weakness. Rather, it is strength under control, like a strong horse is tamed and able to be bridled. For people, it is the restraining of one's own power for the purpose of making room for others. Examples of meek people in the Bible include Moses. Numbers 12.3 says, Moses was very meek above all men on the face of the earth. Jesus was someone who was weak, who was meek. In Luke 23.34, while being executed, Jesus prayed that God would forgive those who were administering the beatings and cruelty because he said, they don't know what they're doing. In what in 1 Peter 3, 4, meekness is equaled with a gentle and quiet spirit, which is so precious to God. Verse 5 says, Women of old trusted God and submitted to the authority of their husband. Verse 6, Like Saint, like Sarah, who, sub, who was submitted to Abraham. Meanwhile, husbands did not lord their strength over their wives. Verse 7, In the same way, husbands gave honor to their wives treating them with understanding. She may have been weak, but she was to be considered an equal partner in God's gift of new life. The reward for this dis this display of meekness, prayers would not be hindered. As believers, we walk in meekness when in verse 8, we have compassion on one another. When we don't repay evil for evil done to us, rather we bless those who persecute us, praying God will bless them, Romans twelve fourteen. Another time Jesus displayed meekness was in this triumphant entry into Jerusalem as evidence that he was the Messiah. Though he is king of kings, he came in meekness, riding on the jackass, Zechariah 9.9, 9, Matthew 21.5. Jesus tells us in Matthew 11.29, Take my yoke upon you and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly in heart, and you shall find rest for your souls. Ephesians 4.2, we are instructed to always be humble and gentle, patient with each other, making allowances for each other's faults. Why? Because of our love for each other. Word of encouragement. Another great uh, example of strength under control is seen in 1 Kings 19.11, when God spoke to Elijah to go stand before me on the mountain. The Lord passed by in a windstorm high enough to move rocks happened, but the Lord was not in the wind. An earthquake happened, but the Lord was not in the earthquake. A fire happened, but the Lord was not in the fire. After the fire was a gentle whisper. Our almighty God was in the gentle whisper. Have a great day.